A good trading journal will provide you with hints and insights as to which direction your trading journey is headed. Is it heading to disaster or is it heading to accumulation of wealth? Last time, I updated my PL Trades journal. I entered around 50 closed trades or so. If you want to know more about PL Trades, I will discuss more about them later on. Keeping a journal to all my trades was one of the first thing I learned when I decided to try to learn and study stocks trading back in 2019. Back then, I still didn't realize the importance of keeping a trade journal. But I keep journaling my trades because it is one of the most highlighted and most advice things to do on any stocks trading book I have read. The only inconsistency I had in terms of keeping a stocks journal is that I use so many type of stocks trading journal formats. First, I use the trading journal format of uh, Dr. Alexander Elder, the author of the book, The New Trading for a Living. It is a very nice book that I read earlier. So later on, I used also the trading journal format of Mark Minervini. So in his book, he mentioned the details that you should journal, the details from your trades, which is essential for you to record. So it is a very, very good format coming from him. So later on, I came also across a trading journal format shared by one of uh, the traders then member it was a very very nice format in uh, excel that i am in love with it and i am still using this format until now because it has some graphic representation easy to understand uh, reports or data presented in a way that it is easy to understand so more on that later also so I'm using this uh, format specially or specifically in journaling my trades as a TDS student. I am also using a personal finance software called Quicken. It has also a feature that allows me to record all my stocks position, my open and close trades, apart from its capability to record all other aspects of uh, personal finance uh, that needs to be recorded like the income expense assets net worth etc you can also generate lots of reports from this particular software called quicken quicken also is my main journal as i recorded most if not all of my personal finance stuff uh, such as uh, tracking my assets my liabilities and net worth quicken is also my go-to software to record my large long-term investments in stocks i also recorded my pera or yung personal equity and retirement account uh, contributions on quicken so let me know in the comment section if you are interested to know more about quicken if i get a lot of comments about it i might create a full video about it as well so back to the main topic of this video if you notice i talk a lot or i talk about lots of journal formats already so what's the whole point of this what's the importance of having or keeping a stocks journal well like any other businesses, you really need to record all your transactions because number one, it is better to write the p list ink than keeping it in your most retentive memory. Or simply said, the p list ink is better than the best memory. It's from a Chinese proverb, if I'm not mistaken, don't quote me on that, um, which, uh, you know, I cannot forget until now which was thought when i was in high school so my teacher used to write that one on the board because many of us don't want to write you know very lazy to write on our notebook than the things that they discuss on the uh, blackboard or the chalkboard you know so back then in high school so he kept uh, this particular um 
proverbs or sayings, if you may, doon sa aming uh, blackboard. So, number two, uh, a good trading journal that records the details of your trade will uh, provide you lots of uh, different matrix to guide you on how you're going to proceed forward with your trading. So a journal can generate reports such as your batting average, your uh, also your batting average per trading strategy. If you used more than one strategy, just like here in uh, Traders Den, uh, maraming strategy na tinuturo. So you can monitor or you can record all the trading strategies that you use per trade. So based on that records, you can generate report specifically on that particular strategy that you use. So you can also record or you can also generate out of those details that you record uh, your uh, profit factor na sinasabi, no? Then your edge ratio, trade expectancy, and uh, risk management also, and among others, no? Number three, a good trading journal also will provide you with hints and insights as to which direction your trading journey is headed. Is it heading to disaster or is it heading to accumulation of wealth? Number four, keeping a journal is done by professionals or by professional traders. How much more the retail traders like you and me? So we should keep it if we want to be on that pro level so what i've mentioned right now were just few of the many good reasons why we should keep a record of all our trades let's take a look at pl trades right now so pl trade is a free social stocks trading journal platform created to those who traded stocks in the philippine stock market all you have to do is sign up for an account and you can start recording all your trades right away you can also write what you feel or your emotional state during the trade because there's a place for that too so you can also record your withdrawals your deposits and you can also interact with other users so in the beginning i mentioned that i entered like 50 closed trades already um, actually i was like abandoning my journal here as i already maintained uh, two separate journals already so i realized that it's better also to maintain pl trades as this is also a very good place uh, to keep a journal to show transparency on what i am doing here in this channel because you can view it anytime you want because it is online so at the end of the day um, i wanted to prove if i can succeed in stocks trading if i really you know can make a living out of it or make a living out of stocks trading and be a full-time stocks trader soon so i believe pl trade is a good place to share if you not have a trading journal yet or you are still undecided to which trading journal format to use well PL trades is a good place to start so if you are interested with all or any one of the trading journal I've mentioned in this video just click the corresponding link below most of them are free to use but if you choose to use quicken the link I provided included an affiliate link which means when you click my link and buy Quicken, I will get a small commission without any added cost from your end. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, share the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank you so much and I will see you on the next one.